Hello guys, Neopet Times here, welcome to a new video and today we have here the latest and greatest product that Apple has released in their online store which is the polishing cloth. Okay, so this came to the store the same day that the new MacBook Pros were released and it's been a success, it's sold out for the next like 10 or 12 weeks uh, but I got my hands on one on launch day, which is today, and we're gonna check it out. So the box, the box is this um, Apple style box. It's very, very, very thin. It's even thin, way thinner than an iPhone 13 Pro Max with the case. And yeah, elongated. So it is the same cloth that comes with the Pro Display XDR, or even with the iMac, I think, uh, to clean the nano texture glass. So if you have one of those, uh, one, either you can skip this one because it's the same one, or if it's very old or dusty or whatever, you can buy a new one. This is not cheap by any means. It retails for 25 euro or 19 pounds or 19 dollars as well. So yeah, it's not cheap. But yeah, let's open it. Have this here to peel off. It's, it's paper this time, I think. I don't know, I could be wrong, but I think it's paper. And look at it in all its glory. They have the polishing cloth. Let's do that again. Uh -huh. So this is good to clean pretty much any Apple product. In Apple's website, they even have the compatibility list um, for every single Apple product. But not all iPhones, interestingly. There's something here. It says, a safe for use in all Apple displays and surfaces for infrequent cleaning to hard to remove smudges of nano texture glass. A 70% isopropyl alcohol solution may be used. So yeah, um, here it is. It has the embossed Apple logo. Very, very, very nice. That's only on one side, not on the other. Um, it's interesting that they released this at the same time as the MacBook Pros because I remember the 2012 Apple uh, MacBook Pro that I had came with a cloth on itself to clean free in the mm, in the box free. Not this time, but I, I will admit this one is way nicer. It's very 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 soft, and we're gonna try it out and clean some stuff with it. Okay, so the first thing we will try to clean is this iPhone SE. I don't know if you can see it on camera, but it's very, very, very dusty. And we will see the magic of the cleaning cloth. Let's clean the screen. Oh, it's very nice because it's, it's clearly hard to move it around, which indicates that it's really cleaning it. So it's not like it slides through the surface. You really have to press down on it. And it's good. Now, it's definitely better, not perfect, but better. But yeah, the thing about this cloth is that it will get uh, dust in it over time, so it will stop cleaning as well. Yeah, this iPhone wasn't really clean to begin with, so... But yeah, it's, 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 uh, this is stain here. Maybe it's to clean finger, fingerprints. <laughs> we'll see. Okay, let's jump to another device. Okay, so this is my MacBook Pro and you cannot see it just right now because it's on, but it's very, very dusty. So now, as well, you can see my room, but you can see it's very dusty in general. So we will test the magic of the cleaning cloth. Oh, it is really cleaning it, I want to say. Even the fingerprints, the edges, yeah, it's nice. Here's a hard to remove one. I don't happen to have isopropylic alcohol, so I cannot test that feature of the cleaning cloth. But other than that, it's not too bad. Yeah, it definitely did a better work with this one. Uh, than with the iPhone. Let's see it again. I think you can see the before and after. 
But yeah, let's go ahead and test it with another device. This is an iPod Shuffle 4th generation and it's funny because it's listed in the compatibility page on the Apple Store but it doesn't have a display in case you didn't notice. But still, for, uh, for the sake of science, we're gonna test it. It's, uh, I would say it's hard to clean because, yeah, as I said, it's like very thick cloth, so it's hard to move it around. But yeah, look at how clean it is this time. I must admit it, it was pretty clean to begin with, but it's pristine now. Okay, so this was the unboxing and review of the Apple cleaning cloth. As I said, uh, it's very nice. It's made of some microfiber, uh, very, very soft. It really looks like if, you, it, if it were to touch any surface, it will not make a single dent on it, which is what it's supposed to do. And also it will clean it. It's also very thick. So if you put some isopropylic alcohol, as it says here, it will probably not be bad for the thing, like it will not uh, penetrated so I think I would say it's even two layers it has to be because there's like the apple that was only on one side but nothing on the other yep so so yeah but yeah this has been everything about the polishing cloth um, if you have any questions about it please feel free to ask them down below in the comments and I will do my best to answer also if you like this video, please thumbs up and if you didn't, please thumbs down and let me know in the comments what you did like about this video so I can improve for the future. Also, if you really, really, really like this video and if you really like Apple products, you can consider subscribing because I upload new videos every week, uh, teaching you tips, uh, unboxings, everything for your Apple products. But yeah, that's gonna be everything for me for today. Thank you very much for watching and see you in the next one. Bye.